Hey guys, this is Trouble Lobster coming at you with another review of this very interesting Lego minifigure. Now before I start this review, I just want to say I'm using my new camera and tripod now. And uh, this video should be in 1080p or HD in some words. Okay, so let's get this started. Now this is not an average size minifigure. This is a very, very big minifigure. If I can zoom out. He's huge. As you can see, he's like that big. Uh, let me grab another one for comparison. This guy up here. Look at the size difference. That's a uh, clone trooper. This is pretty much twice the size. This guy's really cool. Um, I got this guy in my stocking on Christmas. Very interesting. Now, um, I'll show you what these are in a second. But he can't walk on anything. Like, he can't click on little Lego studs when he walks. But, um, he does do everything a minifigure can do. He can bend his wrists. He can do this with his, um, arms. Move his head. Move his legs. Although, I haven't tried taking him apart. And he can't do that. He can't split in half. But, he came in this package. Just this little bag. Um, I haven't taken the instruction tags off him yet. But, it's basically just... That kind of gives them what it does. Then it just kind of tells you how to replace the batteries and everything. I'll take that off in a second. But here's the interesting thing. It is a flashlight. That's what these are. And you press this little Lego symbol. See, it lights up. I'll show you. See, he's a Lego flashlight. Keychain flashlight. But he looks just like a regular minifigure. No detailing. Besides, I guess, this Lego emblem. But you push the button, and it lights up. Pretty nice, too. Not very heavy. But, that is the Lego minifigure flashlight. And thank you for watching. Please rate, comment, subscribe. And I'll have reviews of the new 2011 Lego Star Wars sets coming soon.